Welcome hobby enthusiasts to the Minimal Tabletop video advent calendar with Christmas hobbying ideas, quick tips and more. Today I show you how I batch painted these guardsmen. I started by priming them with Mechanico Strandard Grey. Then I sprayed the guardsmen with Zenry dust from above. That gives a first contrast and saves me a few steps. With Lead Badger I highlight the metal elements on the last gun and the other equipment of all five guardsmen. One advantage of painting in batches is that you save time between the drying of individual layers. When I'm through with all five, I can already apply the second layer to the first model, etc. Next up is Monfing Brown, which I apply in two to three thin layers to the casing of the last gun and the armor plates. The skin elements are given a layer of Doomball Brown for now. I paint the leather details and shoes with dried bark. Now I'll use Sandry Dust to fix all the spots on the uniform that I've worked on a bit messily. And the imperial symbols are getting a coat of runewood brass. After that, I generously shade everything with Agrox Earth Shade. After the shade has been able to dry nicely, it's time for painting the skin which I roughly highlighted with a thin layer of Bugman's Glow. I only let Doomball Brown shine through in the darkest areas. For the face and the hands I spend most of my time with the Guardsman, because that is where the viewer pays the most attention. With Cadian Flash then I highlight a bit more selectively and let more of the darker tones come through. For an even finer highlight I mix Cadian Flash on 50-50 with Deep Can Flash and only pick out the places where most of the light was hidden. The eyes are each given a dot of Deepkin Flash. And then an even smaller dot of Abaddon Black. With that the Guardsmen are ready to serve as cannon fodder for the Emperor. Faces and hands are the most outstanding features of mass infantry units such as Guardsmen. And they find every bit of extra time that you put into these details raises the models to another level. I hope you enjoyed the video and still wish you and your loved ones a relaxed pre-Christmas time. And don't forget, keep fighting grey plastic.